Roblox is in huge trouble, and I don't say that often. In fact, this is one of the saddest days in Roblox history, but Mixer V, what's wrong? You're on your Roblox profile right now, everything seems fine. Roblox isn't shutting down. If I go to the Discover page, it's not like Roblox has been hacked, all the games out there have enough players. It's not like the site shut down or anything, so... What's wrong? Why is Roblox ruined? And when I say ruined, I mean it. All I'm gonna do, if I go to the search page right now and I just type in the word bacon hair, the famous word bacon hair, and we hit end, you can see there are a ton of bacon hairs, the most iconic Roblox avatar out there. It's been like this on Roblox for years and years, but I have some bad news. This is where all of this drama actually began. Roblox is taking a lot of faces off sale. This is the winning smile, one of the most iconic Roblox faces in the world. Someone replied and they said, end of old Roblox. And if you thought that was bad, or maybe you think it wasn't bad at all, it gets worse. These aren't just faces I'm talking about either. Well, first of all, they're taking all of these off of sale, this one as well. Really iconic Roblox faces too. They are trying to end old Roblox as we know it. People are extremely upset about this but this is only the beginning of the story all of these faces these iconic faces too going off sale and you know a lot of people don't really care about faces going off sale but i know something you will care about now if you're not living under a rock you would know what's going on i just searched on twitter roblox is ruined and there are so many posts eight minutes ago ten minutes ago an hour ago everyone is saying that roblox is just ruined now this is where the issue begins this is a site called the Wayback Machine, and it's basically a time machine. You can see every single year of Roblox in the history of the game, ever since 2004, before a lot of you guys were even born. You can go all the way to 2023. Now here is where the real issue comes in. I'm on the Roblox wiki and I'm on a site that says Avatar. It basically describes all of the default Roblox avatars. You can see this is a classic Roblox girl. And you can see we can go through the years of every single classic Roblox avatar. For example, from 2011 to 2014, this is what a boy on Roblox looked like when you made the account. Which is why we are now playing old old Roblox on this time machine. And if I go to games right now, this is where the story gets 10 times worse. If you click on any of the most popular games, for example, one of the most popular only had 850 players. Comparing to now when games have over millions of players, the default people playing these games were obviously that guy wearing the hat. And then in 2014, out came the bacon hair. And ever since the bacon hair came out from 2014, nine years ago, bacon hairs on Roblox literally became this super funny meme. This is iconic, but now we have a huge issue. This original tweet was from July 26, 2023, which is about two days ago, and it seemed pretty innocent. Roblox seems to be testing a new set of default avatars when creating a new account, equipped with a support for layered clothing and dynamic heads. You look at this, and it looks very human-like. There's girls, there's boys, everything thing seems okay, but when you think of the word testing, you never think it's something that they're actually going to make a change on, especially in a span of two days. Now here's the thing, Roblox has been experimenting with different avatars for a while. Roblox update 2022 last year, everything you need to know about the Roblox update, and you can see there's a bunch of updated avatars, but these still look like Roblox. In fact, this post is from eight months ago, and if you scroll down, here is what it looked like. It still looks like Roblox, obviously, except for this. But it was super cool when Roblox added the layered clothing update. You could be more like a person while still keeping your blocky avatar. And then you start to see stuff like this. You have this normal Roblox face, and then it starts to look a little bit more like a human. Everyone was wondering what was going on. Why is Roblox making their avatars look more like humans? This is where it all starts. New Roblox default avatar. What are your opinions? opinions and this is real 
the bacon hair pal is gone and it's replaced with this. But it gets even worse because there are multiple variants of it. This just doesn't even look like Roblox anymore as we know it. But has this secretly already happened or are they just planning it? All I'm gonna do right now is log out of my Roblox account. Let's just go ahead and hit the sign up button and we're gonna see if I make a brand new Roblox account right now, July 28th, 2023. Has this change already gone into effect or does Roblox still have time to change this? All right, we're gonna just do a random birthday. Roblox, please don't remove bacon. All right, I made that username a little too long. How about BCN? It's still too long. Okay, I think that's perfect. Roblox, please don't remove bacon. Now let's just make a quick password. And what is my avatar about to look like? If I don't have a bacon hair for one of the final days in the world, I think I'm going to cry. Three, two, one, sign up. Okay, we are back on my profile, Nicholas77. And if we go to my profile, three, two, one. Roblox, please don't remove bacon hair. Okay, the account is still a bacon hair. The default avatar has changed, but it hasn't gone into effect yet. Guys, if you're watching this, we need to put a stop to this. Hashtag save the bacons. Now, this is crazy. Obviously, the default avatar was updated, so that means it's already in effect. But if I made my Roblox user and it doesn't have the new avatar, I have a feeling there is a way somehow to activate it. Let me go to my settings right now. Obviously, if you didn't know about last year, beta voice chat officially became huge. You had to go to your settings to enable it so i'm just kind of thinking is there anything here that changes your avatar into this brand new user app permissions parental controls billing security my only thought is maybe account info but you can see nothing looks out of the ordinary but here's where things get crazy. Someone just tweeted, no! Roblox changed the default avatar to Arthro, and this looks horrifying. So it's not just that one dude I showed you before. They also look like this. Let me go to the account right now and see if this is actually real. New default avatars with two S's. So to me, it seems like this feature is only rolling out to a few select people. New default avatars just like this in people and oh my gosh what is that <laughs> no this is not roblox anymore look oh my gosh okay hold on I mean, we're literally at the point where these are real human looking avatars. And the fact that this dude is only in his boxers, right? This is like, this is an, this is an issue. This should not be allowed on the game. I mean, that's at least my opinion. I'm getting a little mad. I'm not even going to lie. And ladies and gentlemen, the change has officially, as I'm speaking, went into effect. I am looking at a Roblox account right now that has the exact same avatar as the one in the tweet that everyone is freaking about everyone bacon hairs are gone subscribe for more